Hey everyone, welcome back to Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain. We got some side ops to do today. Uh, this one we're not going to be doing for a while because I'm going to have to go through here and this area here is story Like if I go through there, our main mission will trigger. Triggered. Uh, so we will not be going for the Star Arm blueprint just yet. Uh, I do believe we will be starting uh, on the Smossy Lamont. And then go to the Guandi K. And yeah. Yeah, we'll start here, here, and then go past Wasind. Wasind. Uh, uh, Dewilo is a, um, Dewilo is this again. It's reactivated itself because I went and did the prisoner extraction too from there. So, let's so start with the unlucky dog, then get that heavy infantry. Alright, so let's. We will start here. Uh, we're gonna have to go to Mother Base sometime. Well, we're we're staying in the field the whole time, so I think we'll be fine. All right. Eliminate the heavy infantry. Maybe they'll be good heavy infantry. I think heavy infantry are literally just like the giant like tactical armored plating dudes maybe ish I don't I don't know I haven't a bloody clue as of right now honestly I'm just getting some recording done so I can uh you know cuz I'm not gonna have much time to do it during the week of course cuz I gotta get it on my days off Guts to get them them records, Dune. Ugh, I'm gonna go for a freaking shower and stuff at Mother Base soon. I am a mess. Mr. Big Boss, you sir are a mess right now. Okay, let's see here. Side op list. Side op. So. One, two, three. Yeah, it isn't even at the Yako. I guess one I was still stealing someone from here or something. Oh yeah, it's unlucky dog number one. Be down. Be careful down there, boss. Oh yeah, uh, also, uh, I'm also doing these side ops before I do any of the main ones because at least two of the main ops require rocket launchers and I'm still working on making a good one. Yeah, I mean, all that, like, R&D stuff and getting new guns and whatnot is, um, it's important, but not, like, important enough for me to, like, take the time and, like, have to wait to show you guys, so... Yeah. It's important, but not that important. Alright, D horse, you stay here. D horse. Yeah, I can make D horse uh, crap now, apparently. Oh, Lord. Did I wreck this place last time I was here, or what? Jesus. Oh no way I remember. I'm I'm remembering now. I came back here to get all the mission objectives for the honeybee. And I do believe that was me that blew all the stuff up. Okay, I don't have a freaking combat team, so I'm not even gonna bother trying to extract that guy. You're a decent support guy. I 
Alright, that guy's got two Bs. Just gotta get you guys out of, like, me out of the seeing area. Oh, that guy's got a freaking rocket launcher. Subject on board. That's not a good us. thing. So this guy will be able to tell me where the, uh... Yeah, it's not a good thing. He's got a Uzi and and a rocket launcher. That's not good at all. I've never seen guys having rocket launchers. You shut your ass up. You tell me where the prisoner is right now. Shut up and tell me where the prisoner is. Right now. He's here. Thanks, man. Right on. I wonder, can I, like, Phantom cigarette. Cigar. Make it nighttime. Shit, a brick it got sandstorm. That's the sacrifice I'm willing to make. Hey, rocket launcher, dude. I'm sorry, boss, but the extraction failed. I'm okay with the that. The support unit just isn't skilled enough. I know. If you want to increase okay. the success rate of Fulton extractions in bad weather, you need to improve the support unit. God, it's so freaking sandy out. Wait, hey, question, are you even any good, Mr. Rock Launcher guy? Yeah, you are, actually. Fairly good. Requet. You're... Medicine, Roger so that. he'll be um, pretty good. We got another Soviet guy around back here. Maybe if that ain't a bird or something. Get down. The enemy sniper. Stay low and crawl along the ground. That should enable you to sneak past enemies. 
Ooh, sniper, you're very, you're very good. Ah, uh, there must be a guard inside there as well. But I, could, I know for a fact there's a guy in there. Come on. Mmm, yummy. Get, get. Oh, there's more than one prisoner. That's the target. What? There's two of them. But what? what? Uh, confused. Uh, a little bit. Um, however, that dude there is really good. Ah oh, damn. Meant to be uh you know extracting you dudes. Okay, subject is in. Just get yeah, drop that right on his head, would you? Subject oh, I didn't know that there were were actually two two unlucky dogs. Like two dudes in the unlucky dog side off. As I say, our thing best be improved. I mean, after all, we did uh, get all that crap together as well. Ready to hit you. Dude, just. Stop. Mr. Sniper, I, if at all possible, I would love to take you alive right now. Please. Oh, apparently that was not in any way a lethal shot. You're screaming in the, in the wilderness. And subject on board. Leave the rest to us. There we go. Perfect. Now let's go and finish off this fellow. This fine gentleman over here. Did he die? Oh, I was gonna say, did he die or mm, am I just not seeing him? Hello, friend. He's on the brink of death. It's hard to say whether he'll survive a full extraction. If you I even shoot. Oh yeah, I'm afraid I shot in the knee. You better use the chopper. Just but if you're gonna up. carry them, put, them to sleep <coughs> put you down. You won't get far if you have to fight them every step. All right, let's take. Uh, I think we have enough time at least to go to objective B and do that one. At least objective B. Whoa, whoa. Turn the hell around, D horse. There we go, finally, Jesus. Where the hell is the road? Oh, I'm stupid. There it is. Jesus. I don't like how D horse has to stop rear back. The boss has to yell, whoa, whoa. And all that, I hate how long it takes, you know? Yeah, you know. 
Alright, let's get going. I'll leave the area once I get all my side ops and crap. Soldier, one. Sniper class. How good? Question mark. Unit function? Oh, I can do sleeping gas again. We all know how helpful that was. Not too helpful, not too not helpful. Well, actually, nah, it was pretty helpful. Earlier, wait, did I even use it? Motherfucker. Screw you. <laughs> yeah, that's the way I wanted to go. This, yeah, I wanted to go the up and around. Here, because I felt like the relay base and all that like stuff would take forever. Would you? Would, sir. Yes, I already did red breast. I'm pretty sure what, like the next three, like out of the next three, two of them require a rocket launcher because there are tanks involved. Then like start introducing in like the armored battalions. Armored divisions and stuff. Then that gunship, of course, was to introduce helicopters and whatnot. Of course. So. The honeybee mission. As well as, you know, rocket launchers, heavy artillery and stuff. It's, it's all about an evolution of uh, weaponry. In this game. Like, you start out with small arms and infiltration, then you slowly move up to needing, like, the ability to freaking obliterate stuff and things and whatnot. And then it just gets a little awkward. I just have this because I, if I mean if, if anyone's on the road, I'm not gonna pick them up and carry them anywhere. I'm just gonna shoot them. All right, let's go deep. Let's go to horse. Quar Quariasa Karhai. Another really good way to freaking get people on the on the roads. Just fire a snipe rifle and they will start searching for you. Damn it, D-Horse. Why can't you just jump off of that? Oh god, there's like infinite like ways around stuff in this game. Too many pathways. Too many like choices of like which ways to go. Aw, oh, I want clear weather. See right here, I could go either around the whole freaking yeah. army base yeah. or through it. And that is what we call the circle of yeah. secrecy. Alright, so no matter how long this next bit takes, yeah. I'm going to be doing this one on camera yeah. uh, for B, and then we'll move on to C, yeah. and then if there are no more side ops, besides, of course, the Stun Arm side op, obviously. Uh, we will do though. We will do a main mission, which I think is gonna be one of the armored ones. Yeah, there's two ones with say recommended r r rocket launcher, and the other one is to rescue a dude, which is gonna be a pain, cause, uh, cause like, there's like a whole bunch of different bits where, like, there's like a whole load of different specialists you can like rescue, and it's annoying because like sometimes like prisoners will get executed or whatever for like no reason I want I have an idea second and I realized that it was not going to the outpost I was thinking I could sneak in the back of that truck I could sneak into the outpost through the back of that truck that's that's what my thoughts uh, were if, if that at all seemed like a decent idea I felt like that was a good idea at the time at least Alright, and enemy presence 
detected. Somewhere in this area, which is objective B, it's somewhere in that area of motion, field of movement. Which also happens to have a lot, a lot of fairly decent guards in it. Uh, is it like I might just get those guards on my own time, but you know, you know how it is. Wormwood. So somewhere around here is some dudes. Now quickly, my question is. stuff here. Skilled soldier. The good news is, I have not killed the highly skilled soldier yet. Oh, this is gonna be a while then because I have to find every guy. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Helicopter, like now. Roger. <laughs> you, you would be the the, the freaking special soldier I'm supposed to not kill. You would be. You uh. Come on, get over here quickly, quickly, horse. Now I need you. Come on. Pick him 
А! Put him on the freaking horse. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm okay. I'm not gonna take him out of the area. I just need to steal this guy. Uh, cause I may have accidentally wounded his ass. Alright, Pequod, I need you like to be here like now. This is Pequod. Have arrived at LZ. We'll stand by. Okay. I got a Pequod. Don't worry. Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be f just fine. This is Pequod. We can't land. Why? Are you kidding me? You can't land because of a puny little sandstorm? Land your ass right now! You've got to be shitting. Can I smell? Oh my god! That's retarded. Fine. Fine, I will literally freaking smoke. Just to make this stupid ass sandstorm go. Smoke. Oh, I see. He died because someone wouldn't land. You're fired, Pequod. Get out. Right the hell now. Ah. Alright, guys. Uh, that's the end of the video because Pequod's a worthless asshole. Uh, and can't just land because of a puny little bitch ass sandstorm. Anyway, I will see all of you in the next video where hopefully Pequod is an idiot and will land his ass immediately. Goodbye.